Hey guys, uh, say come in. <sighs> I'm recording this on my, uh, my previous device, so yeah. Quality, quality might be very different, so. So, and you know, I did a video. I made a this deck against, and now we'll play it. I'm trying to figure out how to like crank it up. Bam! I just recently heard that the thing that I hold on that attack was that I played. I don't know why. That was the start of it. So uh, it was uh, it was uh, my first uh, freestyle like this match against uh, Evil, and the reason I did this was. <coughs> So this should this should have been a belly at least two weeks ago at Queen's University. A group of people I was told by by my friend who was there, by there was a group of people who were like uh Target targeting people who are like LGBT and uh, me and uh, Aboriginal uh, people. Yeah, it was a uh, quoted uh, indigen indigenous uh, people. Same thing. Uh, I've looked it up. So what happened was like uh, at the ch town hall. Which is like a part of uh, Queen's University, yeah. And like a, I guess a special dormitory or something. Oh, that was on the fourth floor, and uh, so the both, so there was like a whole bunch of there was a uh, racist poems, like uh, they were like posted all over the place. And then, like, the fourth floor at Chown Hall is basically, like, for, like, the indigenous and allies uh, community area. So, that's understandable. Like, at least 50, 50 students. So, that's fairly a lot. And then, like... So, like, the part of the call was, like... Call was this. And I fa fairly think that's is very racist. So what happened was they uh, they took uh, the the my friend's uh, LGB, LGBT flag, the rainbow flag, and then uh, they took took another student's uh, um, like, you know the Aboriginal the Métis flag, and from what I've heard, and then even the principal and even the principal he says this is just it's just crazy and like just terrible. I understand that because it's just yeah, completely racist. Now there's like another post brought to you by uh, Crazy Journal. There's my one of my friends. I don't know who she is, but she was also victimized. So. Yes, I just figured uh, what happened was just freaking, ter freakingly terrible, and yeah, yeah, like it's like people I know and like hate people or don't accept the, the Aboriginal. Like, geez, like what's your my fucking problem? I, well, I'm I'm assuming probably your motto was like, uh, yeah. yeah. Anyways, uh, let's talk to. Uh, I figured out uh, I might uh, stick up for, for people and uh, for like that uh, this uh, so this was a free song so of course I didn't write stuff down so but I, I can tell you guys what I wrote down so 
first off, it's um, it's saying that I just found out about what just happened. I am not happy about it. And then like, you know, like talking to, you know, like just you know to people like, like oh, so you know, like you know, like you took their flag and then like, you know, you made them cry and cry. You mean you planning like they threaten them and like they're gonna kill them at midnight or something? And such and like man, many people many students uh, at October 10th uh, they were like too scared to be around so they of course they went on for Thanksgiving holidays because of course it was Thanksgiving holidays uh, lots of people are out out there like celebrating with the band or working at their own job before you know they went off to And if they're like, uh, instead of like, oh, if they're going to they act like that, then, oh, then your model must be like, I want to, I want to get a knife and I'll kill, I'll kill people. I don't know, no, like the other part of what I was saying is like, saying like racist, racist, being racist to other people is just like completely rude. And, uh, and yeah, because, uh, me being an Asian, uh, I've been uh, attacked by, uh, I've been like attacked verbally, and uh, and uh, yeah, it's not a not a good fun thing to deal with. It's just terrible. Well, like sometimes like, people like either like mistake me for like another per another uh, con country person. Uh, uh, I'm not from China. I'm not from Japan. I'm not from Thailand. I'm from Korea. So yeah, that got that right. So yeah, sorry. Sorry. All right, back to the. So it's hard, very hard to deal with the racist stuff and. And then I was called a certain word that's very racist to uh, Chinese and Korean people, so that was the I'm done with. And, yeah. But those flags, like, they represent those like who those who they are. It's like not just like what what country they're from. But also like like what they believe in like where they're where they're from like what kind of, what kind of, you know like Aboriginal, Aboriginal like what kind of like you know area like some of the some uh, Aboriginal areas I know is like Tyandinaga and uh, Alderville eh, this is a nice nice places there's a school there public school. Sometimes it's competition, uh, but yeah, yeah, nice kids. But, but technically, being like, insulting like uh, like uh, Aboriginal people, like they were, they, their people was technically here, like here in like Canada first before like the Europeans, and like you know. In other places, in other places, like so, yeah, like everyone, everyone slowly, slowly made their way from other countries, from Af Africa, the continent of Africa, Asia, Europe, South Africa, so, you know, you name it. And also, uh, Africa, Africa, Drew, like you know. The little the white people uh, took their land and uh, you know they became their second second people and you know Aboriginal people they still still they still deserve they're st still technically Canadian because they they were really here first because and you know there is a certain law that say saying that uh, Aboriginal people uh, they have like the right to be Canadian 
of course, there's the right thing, and uh, those people, th those group, those group of people, you better uh, go back to history class and uh, check up on that because, yeah, yeah, because you know, there's a, the, there's the law thing that say that's saying that, you know, that automatically uh, makes a, uh, that technically makes them a Canadian. If, if you are from here or like you have a citizenship. And then another part of the this track I said, on this freestyle rap where I'm the, I said, uh, I am in, and I'm in a mood to put, put, put all of those, those uh, racist uh, students along the wall Get a kid, get a like a small knife or a kitchen knife. Give them a little snap flash to make make them feel like one what, what it feels like to be like cut because because like people like you know they cut their like themselves on their wrist you know sometimes you know and do it to many people have done it for suicide. People have done it for suicide. And don't be rude to the other people that I got. And then I also want to mention, like, like if if those people like, claim like they didn't, they just like attack people and then say they're like good people. Yeah, they're like. Yeah, I feel like if you like say like. I bet most of you, I bet most of those people, uh, people in that group are like uh, white, white people, Caucasians, you know, and uh, yeah, if they, if they got a got problem against you, you know, I mean like, the gay, gay, lesbian, and uh, transgender people, they got a, they got a problem against straight people who are like, like that, like, what if like, the, they attack the straight people like that, the other, other way around. Yeah, there's that issue. It's actually that being a very racist, and and if they they think they're saying they're saying they're good people and they're they're not racist, or sexist, or stuff, nothing. I mean, people are like looking up, looking the word feminist the wrong way, right? So there's that. So yeah, there's that that issue. Oh yeah, there's And like there's people like who like generally attacking like Asians, African, the people, the dark skinned people, and and you know, and then like they have like a hate hatred against like people who are like not from their country of origin, like Canada. Some racist can some people racist people are in uh yeah North America, like I mean Canada and the United yeah USA in this case. So they're like, they're like if they're, eh, I mean, like people from the Europe, they will respect, but anyone who's like from the Middle East, Africa, and uh, or other places, Asia, they will all look up, down upon them. And yes, I have dealt with this before, so. And yeah, I do not want to talk about this uh, even further. But if you have watched my uh, one of my uh, videos, are uh, way 
back then. You don't know. You probably don't want to listen to listen to that part, but it's very. Uh, I don't know. There's this guy uh, who uh, Martian Twelve F, I think. Yeah, that was the guy. So I feel like so what what happened was backstory of Bloody Revenge was a from reading what I said for Bloody Revenge it was a diss track against the guy who was who said racist comments about Koreans in, in the comment section of the video where I was talking about the American Eagle uh, putting it into Jeff. Japan rising sun flag, which is like the Nazi, the Nazi flag, on a shirt, and on, and the guy, the guy went all racist, and I slammed him hard with a chan, and his channel went down for being racist. Yeah. So like, well, he that was the guy who was like uh, liking uh, content about supporting Japan and making fun of Korea, and uh, you know, and some. Weird videos. I don't know why, but anyways, back to so back to the subject, original subject. Uh, so I'm glad that uh, the LGBT uh, students, including my friend Sean, and and as and Aboriginal students as well, uh, they have been uh, managed to uh, they managed to uh, like you know, fight that and yeah, the uh, the feeling better. That's good. They have uh, they have contact contacted like people like associations that uh, support them. Uh, you know, indigenous uh, students and uh, LGBTQ, uh, that kind, of, those kind of people. So, so I'm, I'm glad that happened. And uh, those those uh, students uh, who wrote that racist poem, I still wish. The worst for those students, and I wish they go to hell. And uh, and you know, and, and once the if the school kicks them out, most likely they will because like you do all that kind of bad bad stuff. Then obviously the school is, is kick, going to kick you out, and you know you're over you're over over eighteen. You're obviously going to get charged for like being like being racist and such. And And I hope no university or college lets them and and they will be in the in the lowest of the low. No, so this is supporting those those victims of Queen's Queen's University, including my friend Sean. And yeah, I hope you guys find out who the hell it was. And yeah. Good luck with the university studies. Thank him. Bouncing out.